Alex, um, you've had a, a difficult time with call-offs, the latest being Kieran Tierney. How disruptive has this week been and how difficult has it been for you? Yeah, well, uh, it's obviously the, the amount of players calling off has is, is disrupted the squad in general a wee bit. But in saying that, you know, we, we have prepared the whole week. We know what we want to do. It's it's um, certainly in, in terms of Cairn being in the team, then, you know, that was uh, going to be the case. But um, we, we feel that we have the players here to get us the results that we need. E di që kam shumë mungesa në ekip, por ne jemi pregatitur gjatë gjithë si javës me ekipin dhe besoj dhe kam djesin që lojtarët që kam sot me vete janë të pregatitur për të marrë rezultatin që ne duam. Alex, have you ever experienced anything like this in terms of when you've been a player or in your first spell in terms of the amount of call-offs and, and how difficult it's been? It's a different era. You know, the... You know, you have the performance guys now and every little detail is monitored. You know, when I played back in the day, then, you know, we didn't have performance coaches. You went, sometimes you didn't know, and you, you played through it. But, you know, I'm not saying that every player has to play through it. Kian Tierney was desperate to play for us. He was fantastic in his attitude. Um, but... In, you know, the, the medical from the doctor and the physios decreed that he had to pull out. Ne kemi bërë performansat të mira në këto kod, por janë detaj ato që në mungojnë. Ne kemi luaj të gjithashtu dhe me mjaft ekipe, me ekipe që nuk i njojmë, por jam i vedishëm që mungesat janë një pjesë të lëpsore në kësa ndeshje. Alex, have you had to rip up what your plan was or do you have to change the system now because of the call-offs or is it a case of fitting somebody into what you've already planned? No, we, we, we haven't changed anything um, in terms of the system. We have the players that we feel can slot in to the call-offs. You know, John McGinn obviously calling off as well. Um, and, you know, it's, it's a pity to lose these guys, but at the same time, I've got every confidence in the players that are with us in this trip. Jo, nuk do nuk do të ketë ndryshime, nuk do të ketë aspak ndryshime në 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 sistem, në sistemin e lojës, gjithashtu jam i bindur dhe e ndjej mungesën e këtyre djemve, por me me ekipin, me ekipin që kam dhe me lojtarët që kam në dispozicion, jam i vedishëm se mund të arrim një rezultat pozitiv. Alex, how often have you changed your starting lineup since the start of the week? Um, well, no, not really much. So it's, you know, we have had two obviously very uh, influential players that have dropped out. But, you know, by and large, I don't think that, um, you know, the, the fact that two players are out then. There's not much else affected in terms of what we are planning to do and what we we have prepared for. Përse për këtë reshtimit, unë kam dy lojtarë mjaft të rëndësishëm dhe do besoj do je në shumë, do djet loja e tyre në lojën tonë në si ekip. Do you feel that some of the players who have pulled out could have played on through Knox? No. Um, no, there was absolutely no chance because um, if we have to respect what the, the physios and the doctor, that's why they're here. No, they've got their job and we have ours. So you, you must have total respect for that. Nuk besoj se do t'ishte rasti që këto lojtar do të luanin sot, sepse duhet të respektojmë dhe vendimet e doktorve dhe fizioterapistve, ajo është puna e tyre. Have you had to work hard to keep morale high this week with all the disruption to the squad? No, no, I haven't. The, the morale has been very good since the players arrived. We have trained really well, we've prepared really well. We have, um, you know, had a, a good meeting the day they arrived. We've gone over a few things and 
and I think the players are really looking forward to the game. Moral is to me after the art and an keep you me stir vitor me after me you me pregatitor me after me chin moment in che came in britor na na shipri the letarity and pregatitor per sfida in china pret. Oh, like as, as a, a manage oh, sorry. Okay. sorry, Alec. Can you talk us through what happened with Kieran? Because I seen the train this morning and <coughs> and then was declared unfit. Can you tell us what happened? He, he had a, a tightness in his, um, his leg, his hamstring. And uh, you know that so there was no doubt about it. You, you, don't, you can't mess about with these things. Um, and, you know, right away... He flagged up this morning. You know, he we, he, we, he, he nursed it over the, the week. He was nursing it. He came, had, had a bit of tightness. I think we we all thought it was due to the fact that Celtic played in uh, Astroturf last week. And there was a bit of tightness with uh, all the Celtic guys uh, playing on different surfaces. And uh, Kieran's seen seemed just to linger and that was the reason why we had to make that decision on him when they flagged it up this morning. So Again? Uh, oh, oh, I was just going to, as a follow-up to that, like, do you think if he'd played in grass last week he would be, he'd be okay today for the game tomorrow? If he'd played in grass? Yeah. I don't know, but the, the fact that the guys were tight, then, you know, there is a difference playing in acid turf. There's no doubt about it. I don't want to um, criticise Astrotop pitches per se, but um, the the guys came with a little bit of tightness, and we we said I'll well, wear off, you know, I'll wear off when they, they, you know, when it said the day after the game, then the second day after the game, they get almost like forty eight hours to, um, you know, get back to normal and get back onto the training field. The Tarichi Mongon Scotis, Kapaska, Schweizer, Shenya, Lozia, the Perskat and Deshes, Yaka Luatan from the Avenda is Celtic, the Stoica Pass for Problem as a Mekumban, the Yedisa Kyoka Ardur Sipasoy and Deshev, Chica Luatun from the Av. Persevocate Puetiousness and I look that Luantan from the Av at her Dostamunt Tishta Gati Persfeed and I Neshi Priest. Oh, like, I, I know you said that it's a different era, but to have nine call-offs is extreme. I, I can't remember a, a time when any squad mm -hmm. has had that. Do you wake up in the morning thinking, goodness me, what, what, what have I done? Because each day this week, it looks like there's been a different player you know, falling out of it. And why, why do you think there's been nine per, in particular for, for this event? It's just something that is not in our, our control. You know, that, that's, it's just a little bit of a freak. So it's not, not something sinister, you know. So if you're trying to find the story out of this, then it's, there's there's nothing there. It's just bad luck. The guys have, have played to very high levels. They 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 get pushed to the boundaries in training. They they go to the the, the red zone in training in certain moments, and some some of them pick up knocks and injuries. And unfortunately for us. We were a lot of call-offs at the same time, which is maybe extraordinary, but it's uh, there's nothing sinister in it. It's all genuine injuries. Per se, per kit, nënt mungesa ve që ka ekipi skotsez në dhe i kësa indeshje, janë diçka i që nuk e kemi në në kontrol, është jeshtë fati keq, sepse këto lojtar luaj në nivele mjaft larta, kanë shtyrë shumë fort në stërvitje, dhe kanë kaluar zonën e, e, e kuqe, për thjesht nuk është diçka i jashtë zakonçme, janë gjëra që ndodhe. And finally for me, are you convinced that these players have all called off, that they are 100% behind yourself and Scotland, and should they be called I, up in I'm the future? Not, I'm not, I, I don't think I want to answer that. You know, I don't, I don't see why you're asking a question like that. Nuk do t'i përgjigjen kësaj kërëtje. You don't think they want to play for Scotland? No, no, I'm, right. ju, I'm just asking the question now. If, if are you convinced that everybody <coughs> who is called off wants to play for Scotland? Yeah, you know they they all came. They the the ones that came and have gone. Cairn was bursting to play. John McGinn was bursting to play. 
you know, there, as I said, there's nothing sinister, so you don't need to ask that question. No, ka absolutisht as gjë të keqe këtë, janë thjeshtë dëmtime, vlitarët nuk e kanë një dorë, absolutisht nuk duhet të bëni këtë pyetje, nuk ka absolutisht as gjë të keqe këtu. Mister, një të shpjegim më ratë parë në lidhje me vonesën e këllimit konferences për shtypë dhe dyta sa e njifë në Shqiprinë. First of all, an explanation about... Pas në deshje së parë being late for the press conference, and secondly, how well do you know Albania? Uh, I don't want to answer that question. Even, even the, the first match. <coughs> um, yeah, we were late because the plane was late, delayed in um, Edinburgh. And, um, you know, we, we, we apologize for that. But um, secondly, then, yeah, we, we played a very good game in, in Glasgow, pretty dynamic game and um, we, we know that it wasn't we weren't perfect and we're not perfect yet we are still trying to build something and uh, we know it's going to be a tough game against Albania in their own country in front of their own fans but we have prepared well and uh, you know we we trust the players to give top performance Spari duhet ju kërkoj falje, kemi pasur vonesa me avionin që njëse nga Edinburgh, kjo ishte arsua e vonesës. Së dyti saj përket Shqipëris, ne kemi bërë një ndeshje të mirë në Glasgow, nuk ishte një ndeshje perfekte, por ndërtuam një ndeshje të atil, për saj përket Shqipëris, do jetë një ndeshje mjaftë e forësë, do mos Shqipëria luan në Shqipëria, në shpinë e saj, ne imi pregatitur dhe unë kam besim të kë lojtarët dhe që doja dalë. Dy futbolistët e krau të Shqipëris, Egli Kaja dhe Eros Grezda luajnë në Skotësi. Qëfar mendimi keni për ta kërësish për Eros Grezda në që luan me me Rangersin dhe Egli Kaja në që luan me Livingstone? There are two Albanian football players that play in the Scottish League and Kraja and Grezda What kind of what opinion do you have about Grezda mostly uh, since he plays with Rangers? Yeah, well, I've seen him uh, only in very small moments. I watched obviously the the game he played against Israel, and uh, he was good in that game, in the Israel game. And um, for Rangers, he's I think he's trying to find his um, top fitness because it's. The Scottish League is, you know, they, they try and play a fast game of football and, and he's adjusting to the team. And I think he's getting better every week. So we, we know that he can be a danger to us um, after his performance against uh, Israel. Po e kam vënëre progresin e Grezdës të kë Ranger, kam parë disa momente të shkurtra, gjithashtu kam parë dhe momente të ndeshjes nda Izraelit, a i për përmirsohet jeshtë zatë unë ishtë shumë, por a i duhet të gjej formën, sidomos në ligën skoceze, ku luet një futbol mjaftë i shpejt, por kam vënëre sa i përpërshtatet me ekipin, po formohet edhe më mirë, dhe do tjetë një një rezik për ne. Last few questions for us to do. Aye, Alec, you're bringing in Johnny Fleck on Sunday. What do you expect him to bring to the squad and was there a temptation to bring him in for this game as well? No, well, we did discuss bringing him in, but we felt that, you know, travelling to Edinburgh, Glasgow, and then to Albania, within 48 hours, just didn't make sense, we, especially when we were totally prepared for the game in hand, and uh, we we know what our plans are for this game. So, you know, it, we're delighted to have John, but I think common sense that we bring him in on Sunday, and uh, he can integrate with the, squ with the squad. Then, um, it's not re there wasn't really much time for him to come here and integrate, as you know, that we play tomorrow and we then were away the next morning. So I think it was better to bring him in to the, the squad for the Tuesday night game. What was the name of the player? Fleck. Fleck, okay. Yeah.
përsa i përket lojtarit flek, a i nuk ka uzduar me skuadrën, sepse dhe ishte një njoftim mjafti i lotëshëm ga din bërë në Glasgow më pas në Shqipëri, përsa i përket planeve nuk ishte në planet e mija që ta aktivizoja këtë lojtarë. Atër, Mister, sa po ka përfunduar para pak minuta shkjën deshje misore me stifosve shqiptar dhe tifosve skoces që kanë ardhur të shumë. A mund tjetë kë, këtë e ka përfunduar një barazim një me një, mund tjetë kë një ogur për ditën e nesëme, për ndeshjën e nesëme? Ja, there was a friendly match between the red and black fans and the Scottish fans and ended in a draw, 1-1. And will it be the same result of the match tomorrow? You can't predict a football match in advance. Um, the result, well, people try to, but uh, we, we, I think, suffice to say that we want to give the best performance level, and uh, you know, try and come away from Albania with a victory. 